Friends, how are you all? I am so lucky. Today we will see chapter 8th and subject signs. In that chapter number 11. Chapter name is force and operation. In the previous video, part 2, we have seen up to main 7. Today we will see main 8. Explain the point of the two marks. Number one. The nail is put into a wooden plank from its pointed end. Answer is the area of the pointed end of the nail is very small than that of its head. For the same force, large pressure can be created by small area of the surface. Therefore, the small force produced the pressure sufficient to push the pointed end of the nail into the wooden plank. See the question 2. The soldier has provided the road straps. Answer is we know that larger is the area of contact, the lesser is the pressure applied on an object. Shoulder bag with broad straps occupy larger area and do not exert too much pressure on the shoulders. Hence, we can easily carry the bag. See the question number 3. Porters place a round piece of cloth on their head. When they have a carry, have to carry heavy loads. Answer is the round piece of the cloth increases the area of contact of the load with the head. This reduces pressure and facilitate, facilitates to carry the load. Now see the main uh, nine. Match the following properly. Write the alphabet index of column B in the answer box. Four marks each. Column A. First of all, we will see the column A. Number 1, pressure. Number 2, muscular force. Number 3, magnitude of force. Number 4, gravitational force. And column B. A. Non-contact force. B. Pull or push. C. Force acting on unit area. D. Newton. And E. Contact force. Now see the pressure. Pressure match with the C. Force acting on unit area. Number 2, muscular force match with the E, contact force. Number 3, magnitude of force match with the D, Newton. Gravitational force match with the A, non-contact force. Now see the main 10. Answer the following questions in detail. 4 marks each. With the help of diagram, explain that the pressure exerted by liquid increases with the depth of the liquid column in the container. First of all, we will see the figure see the here water tank is given and here strings of waters are given this one a which is very nearer which falls very nearer b so the distance c this one now see less depth less pressure if less depth then left pressure then b c B and C and A. See this one strings of water. Now here this one increase in depth of water and more depth more pressure. For C more depth and more pressure. Now see answer in the above figure there are three tubes A, B, C of the same diameter placed at different height in a container. In the beginning, all the three tubes are closed with a cork. Now water is filled in the container and then and then the cork. Of all the three tubes is open simultaneously. The water coming out of the tube A falls nearer the bottom of the container. The water coming out of the tube B falls a little way from it. The water from tube C falls far away from it. The depth of water is least near tube A, whereas the depth of water is maximum near tube C. And since the pressure of water in a tube A is less, it falls near the bottom of the container. The water from tube C falls away from the bottom of the container as the pressure is high. 
Thus, from the observation, we can conclude that the liquid that has more depth has more pressure. Now we will see the activities in the next video part 4. Stay safe, stay healthy. Okay, bye.